What's up everyone, Sinistrans here, one back at you with another playthrough. This time, we are going to be going over the game LEGO Batman 2 DC Super Heroes. I know this is a game you wouldn't normally see me play, but since you guys know I'm a huge DC fan, a big Superman fan, Batman, all that great stuff, I thought I would go ahead and get this. Uh, I know a lot of people probably aren't doing playthroughs for this game, so I thought this would be a good chance to uh, kind of broaden my channel a little bit, put this out there. Hope you guys will enjoy awesome commentary, and I'll, uh, of course, if there's a, a good following and people are liking it, I will be making plenty more videos, and they'll be coming fast. But uh, still got all kinds of other playthroughs coming up as well, so stay tuned for those. So let's go ahead and get into this. Let's check out some options here, or coming soon, I guess. What this is. Yama, press that line. The world. Oh, you're kidding me. Lord of the Rings for Lego? <laughs> is lost. For none now live who remember it. You must understand. The ring is my burden. That is something that's also new to the Lego games. Uh, voice. Voiceover. There's never been any voiceover in any Lego games, but now there actually is, and I think that's going to get me a lot more interested in playing these games. Now that is gonna be awesome. They have a cave troll. <laughs> All right, sweet. Actually, uh, pretty much looking forward to playing that. I'm a big Lord of the Rings fan. All right, so we'll go ahead and get into this now. It's kind of weird how that just like magically. Okay, there we go. Options, music. We'll put subtitles on, of course. Check out the game controls. It's been a while since I played a Lego, Lego game. All right, so we're just pretty much winging, I guess. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get into this. All right, slut one empty. Let's do it. I love it's got the old uh, Batman theme to it, the uh, Tim Burton Batman. Definitely, I love that music more than the actual newer Batmans. I think this. Every time I hear this music, this is what kind of Batman brings to me. All right, so enjoy of billionaire industrialists are in for a treat tonight as front runners Bruce Wayne and Lex Luthor face off at the annual Man of the Year award ceremony. Yes, it's Gotham's very own playboy philanthropist versus some bald guy from Metropolis. Here at Gotham City News, we're rooting for the home team. Go Bruce! Hmm. Lex, I'm surprised you took time away from your presidential campaign and came all the way to Gotham City for this. Oh, dear lady, as a nominee, it's my pleasure and privilege to be here. Especially if you win. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've all been waiting for, this year's Man of the Year Award goes to... Bruce Wayne. <laughs> Next year, buddy. Despise that guy. <laughs> who has been there for you? One man who has made it his mission to improve the lives of people around him. He has remodeled our buildings, helped keep our banks free of unnecessary clutter. You have always 
has shown your appreciation. Hmm. And why stop now? Standing ovation? Did not expect that, but I'll take it, and also everything else. Riddle me this. What's green? And found in your wallet. Uh, money. Um, no, not anymore. <laughs> Sorry to rain on your parade, my dear. <laughs> Thanks so much. No thanks. I don't want to get joy buzzed. Oh, don't worry. I didn't want to shake hands. I want your watch. Nice running into you. Let's do it again sometime. Oh, we will. <laughs> what a night. Such an honor. Words fail me. I'm speechless. <laughs> ah, who am I kidding? When am I ever speechless? And what a thrill to finally see myself on the big screen. Look at that face. It's like, what's he gonna say? What's going to come out of that mouth of his? <laughs> sorry to wipe that grin off your face, Joker. You're not sorry. You're not sorry at all. Come and get me! <laughs> okay, here we go. That was an awesome intro. It's just uh, kind of sad to know that uh, Mark Hamill is not playing the Joker. I think he pretty much just... I mean, every, every time I hear the Joker, it's just like got to be him, you know? Can you climb up there? I guess not, so. Alright, so this obviously, as I said, is, uh, I'm not really familiar with the LEGO games, so it might take me a few videos to get used to some of the controls here. Hold B to build LEGO pieces. Oh, okay. Because Batman obviously can't jump two feet up in the air. Of course, the boy Wonder can't do it as well, so... Harley, didn't I just beat you in uh, Arkham City? <laughs> Pretty sure I played that you Harley's stay Revenge. Away from Mr. J. Oh, you come here. Ah, come back here. Where are you going? Oh, nice. Damn it, where are you going? Slow down. Oh, hey, you're gonna try to. What are you trying to do? Do you know who you're messing with? I'm Batman. Hold on, I saw something about a battering, but I'm just so worried about what's what's going on screen. Okay, that's the same thing. So uh, I'm really excited about getting going to be able to play as Superman. Of course, you guys know that Superman is uh, pretty much who I am. Well, <laughs> it's not who I am, but it's like my idol, I guess you could say. Well, I, I really wouldn't say idol, but um, Superman, like he. Yeah, to be amazing, I don't know if I've told you guys this, but Superman is actually what kind of gave gave me the motivation over in Afghanistan. I'm gonna look around this area a little bit before I head down there, just in case there's some collectibles more. But um, it was uh, the reason I say that it was because when I was in Afghanistan, you know, there was a lot of bad things happening around me and stuff like that. And Superman, just the the kind of the whole notion of Superman itself, gave me just like this. You know, you're doing this for a, a bigger reason than yourself. You know, it's for America and all that kind of stuff. I don't know if I've said that to any of you guys, but I mean, that was also the other reason why I got Superman tattoos when I was on leave was because every time that I would be, you know, just taking a shower or just, you know, being anywhere, it just reminded me that, hey, you know, I'm doing this because this is this is for America, you know, so it just kind of gave me that good, gushy feeling, I guess. Um, this thing is lighting up blue, so I'm thinking that you can do something with it, but I don't know what you can do with it just yet. Obviously, we can get a lot of coins just by destroying the environment. I, 
remember back in the day when the first Lego games came out, I think it was uh, the trilogy, Star Wars, the prequel trilogy. Like, right before uh, Revenge of the Sith came out, I think they released the uh, prequel trilogy for Lego, and it just blew me away. I was like, this is awesome. And after that, I really didn't play too much. I played a little bit of uh, Lego Indiana Jones, but, like, just, I mean, like, maybe one level. I really didn't give two shits about it or anything like that. Oh, okay, so Y switches, I guess. You can play Robin. The boy wonder. This is definitely the kind of game where there would be a lot more commentary than normal just because it's a Lego game. <laughs> so, I mean, I can, I can talk about this shit for days. Alright, I think that's enough as far as that. Okay, so RT and Y does it. And LT does. Oh my god, how many buttons do it? I'm what? Oh my god, how many buttons switch your people? It looks like you can do something with that, but I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'm just gonna go ahead and move on. I might sometime later if I can cohorse uh, Carrie into playing this with me. I didn't use that. Hey Harley, what are you doing down there, baby? All right, B. Use a safe switch if you need. Press B nearby to activate it. Oh, okay. Why do you need to use that? I thought in the Lego games it's pretty much automatic. Oh, here's my kind of stuff. We got a drum set down here. Oh, yeah. I love how you can just destroy, like, everything. Just gain a shitload of coins. Uh, this must be where we need to go. No, I guess not. Uh, let's see. This is sparkled up or something. Well, that's cool. Trying to figure out how to get over to the other side. That's one thing about these games is there's like so many different... Uh, Puzzles and ways to do everything, you know. Oh, look at it. It's moving. Maybe you gotta hit it again. Maybe you gotta keep hitting it. Yeah, it looks like it might be something to do with this. Yep, that's what I thought. See, I can do it. I'm smarter than the average bear. Hide and sneak, Batman! Almost sounds like Jim Carrey a little bit. I think that's where he got the inspiration from. I actually thought it was Jim Carrey when I first heard his voice in here. Uh, let's see, you destroy it? No. Let's see if we switch to Batman. Can he? No, I know some things you, I think you need different characters in order to unlock. And like I said, don't expect this to be like the quintessential walkthrough where I'm going to do everything, but <laughs> I'm definitely going to have some fun with this, I think. Alright, hold X to a target. To grab. Seems real fun, though. Alright, I don't know what's over there is. Hold X while grappling to target the next grapple. Gotcha. Huh. Oh shit, there's guys here. <laughs> we'll raise the alarm. I guess we're gonna have to put those back together and use that as like a weight. A special suit is required, huh? Look for a Batman suit signal, jump into it to swap to a new suit, which different abilities. 
Oh, but you're Excuse probably gonna be Batman. Me, now I'm badass. I don't know what that does, though. Oh, okay. I got gotcha. you. <laughs> Bitch, what are you doing? Games and puzzles that make you think. Let's get him! Let's get him, guys! It's just so weird hearing voices in this. I mean, you're just not, it's something that you're just totally not used to. And you can string a lot of shit together. Try to get as many coins as I can in this game, but who knows. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I just kicked Batman. Alright, so I gotta figure out what to do here. It's something with this. You would think it'd be something with this. I don't see anything with it yet. Let's go. So. One more thing, sir. Use the sensor suit to see behind glowing. Press B. Oh, that's cool. What are we supposed to do, though, with it? Ah, okay. <laughs> He's like, I don't know where to go. Oh, you found me. Of course I did. Oh yeah, we're getting to face the Riddler already. What's up, Riddler? Yeah, your ass is knocked out. Alright, let's make sure there's nothing else in this area. To bust. Yeah. This actually might be pretty fun to play. Kind of a break from all the stealthy and actionness that I've been doing, I guess. 